Well, one former UMary athlete turned nurse practitioner received the honor of a lifetime from the Las Vegas Raiders. But the moment was about much more than what he was recognized for. Former University of Mary baseball player Matt Espinoza has spent the last decade serving others as a health care professional. But this year has been much different due to COVID-19. During a time when Espinoza says his job has been its hardest, he was rewarded with a token of gratitude by his company and the Las Vegas Raiders. Our high up medical directors got together and said these are the names that, that, we, that um, we want to go to represent our company, which was... It was quite an honor to be able to say that we got to represent Intermountain Healthcare um, at this event. What he believed would be a meet and greet and photo op at a Raiders game turned into something much bigger. Like three people came over and said, you realize you're the only person to do this outside of Al Davis's wife. Like they like the, this is very special to the Raiders organization and very special to the Davis family. Espinoza was randomly selected out of 20 medical workers in attendance to light the Al Davis Memorial Torch, the 93-foot structure built to honor the longtime Raiders owner. As the time came, you know, I felt my heart racing a bit. I was like, okay, I'm, li I'm listening for three words and then three more words. Like, that's, I got them in my head. I know what I got, you know, I'm just, I'm just looking for my cues. The flame lit right on cue, but what many would have considered a lucky opportunity meant more than words could describe for Espinoza and his family. Matt's grandfather, Raymond, was a lifelong Raiders fan. Yeah, he, he passed away my, my second year uh, when I was playing baseball, so I had to fly back for that. And um, that was one of the hardest days ever, but... It was really special to do that for him, though. Uh, he was in my mind the whole time, and he was a special guy to us. He was. Matt remembers riding bikes with his brother to his grandpa's house to watch Raiders games, even though Matt is a 49ers fan. But now he has a part in Raiders history forever. The team is installing a plaque in the stadium signed by the health care workers to cement the special occasion. I'm going to get to take my kids to it and show them, you know, uh, maybe grandchildren many, many, many years down the road from now. And so, um, yeah, it's something that, you know, it's really, it's really special to, you know, do it second to Mrs. Al Davis, as well as, you know, they, they've kind of enshrined us in that little moment. The moment was something refreshing for Espinoza, who oversees more than 650 patients as a nurse practitioner. But it was just what he needed to stay the course during such a trying time. It, it absolutely gave me personally another wave of energy. Um, it, it was, it was, it was, it was a great stress relief moment to just kind of sit back know that you're 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 being um honored really i mean and appreciated by not just our company but the raiders and the city of las vegas itself espinoza said the health care workers were actually supposed to have lunch with mark davis the raiders current owner but that was postponed due to covid 19. the raiders did guarantee that the health care workers will get tickets to a game next season espinoza said when he does return to allegiant stadium He's going to go and find that plaque, but he says he'll likely be wearing his beloved 49ers jersey when he gets there.